Hands for Robots, enabling technologies that make robots able to go out into the world and do real work. I'm Rich Walker, I'm the Managing Director of the Shadow Robot Company. Over the next 20 or 30 years, I think we're going to see a revolution in robotics in the same way we have with the internet. My name's Eamon McStravick, CEO at Auratech Engineering. We design remote robotic systems. Cubot was set up to use robotics to revolutionise the construction industry. My background was initially mechanical engineering. Before that, as a kid playing with Lego, so always like building things. I got into robotics because I was really passionate about programming computers and no one could see what I was doing. Making things move and act in the world suddenly made it really, really obvious that what I was doing had meaning. Robotics is a huge opportunity for future development. We are working on Miro, which is a biomimetic robotic companion. It looks like a unintimidating small animal. Shadow Hand is the result of about 15 years of development and it's the most dexterous robot hand in the world. It has all the same movements of a human hand to let robots actually interact with the world in the same way that humans do. Remote aerial systems, these are going to become a part of everyday life, whether it be getting airlifted to hospital or a builder will just take it out of his van, carry out a brief remote inspection of a roof, checking roof tiles, guttering. It removes the risk. I think that the future for robotics is, rather than substituting for people, producing devices that can do things we can't do. The puppy can see in the dark and it can hear things that humans can't hear. You know, you can use a silent dog whistle. It will interact with you. It's autonomous, it knows when to charge itself. You don't have to feed it, you don't have to take it for a walk. One of the really exciting things about working at Cubot is that we see the impact on people. Our robot can actually apply insulation and improve the energy efficiency. We reduce energy bills, and so we have very happy tenants who previously couldn't afford to heat their homes. The TSB are helping us achieve our dream in a number of ways. What I hope to get out of this mission is to understand what the state of the art is in robotics. The opportunity to form partnerships where we could both benefit. The opportunity to join up the network of people we need to take this UK technology and really take it out into the world and make a big splash with it. Just one idea that makes us a little bit more efficient or allows us to improve our research and development process is really, really valuable and very quickly pays for itself. Mm -hmm.